because it was just so embarrassing. But I feel like such an Instagrammer already. Okay, we're gonna look at this month's glossy box. I don't know if you can hear my laptop just like trying to take off in the background. Welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new here and welcome to a brand new weekly vlog make sure you go down and subscribe down below if you're new here so you don't miss my videos so today is Tuesday I've started my day off a clear morning I've been watching YouTube in bed I've been up for about an hour and a half it's now 11 o'clock and I've just made myself a iced coffee I'm obsessed at the moment with almond milk um in my iced coffee with with some of the protein vanilla drops honestly it tastes so good also guys, I literally just started chatting for like a minute and thought my phone was like, camera was on, but it wasn't. So I was like, luckily though, the thing that I wanted to show you, I had, hadn't opened. So I ordered a parcel from My Vegan. Um, I do think it comes from the same like company, like My Protein, My Vitamins. I feel like it's all one, but they're all like separate, aren't they? Um, but um, I noticed that I basically, I have, I've been using up some of my, my, my protein um, protein shake recently that I've had for ages because the date says it's May this year. So I thought, all right, better use that. Um, and then the other day, something scrolled up and it was like my vegan and it was like 50% off because it was their birthday or whatever. And I thought, I really want to try some of their vegan protein powders. I'd, I'd wanted to try them anyway. So I thought I'm going to get some. Um, and I, went, I ordered a few. It's too crazy, but basically I ordered three different flavors in the 500 gram um so it's half of obviously that's half of one kilogram just because well i could have they even do samples i could have got samples but i feel like even though samples are great like you pay a lot for like one what is that one portion do you know what i mean like whereas these were on offer and i thought as they were on offer and half price i may as well get like not it's not a big bag but it is the next size down so it's the I guess it's like a medium. So we've got blueberry and cinnamon. I thought I'd try that one. I've got a banana one. And I've also got a chocolate one. I wanted a chocolate because a lot, I've been making like baked oats and a lot of people use like chocolate in like chocolate protein powders and chocolate baked oats and things like that. So I thought that'd be really good to try. And yes, yeah, so I've got those three. Um, and I'm really excited to try them. They also had another one that I wanted to try. I probably will invest in the vanilla at some point soon. Um, and they also had a carrot cake one that I wanted to try, but that one they only had did in a one kg, so I didn't really want to buy a massive bag of it and then not like it. So yeah, I'm gonna use these up before I get any more. I also want to use um, try some like clear protein because uh, like the girls that I've got on like a group chat from beyond were saying like about I never even I've never really thought about getting clear one, but sometimes it's just nice to change it up a little bit, and sometimes sometimes you don't want like a milky drink even with water like sometimes that would be nicer so i'm gonna give those a go but yeah um i thought i would just show you those i've got i'm literally about to get ready look at these spots on the side of my face that i woke up with this morning well i say woke up with i had a few here last night but i woke up and there's like a whole like gang going on here i'm like oh god so what am i gonna do i'm gonna wax some makeup on um yeah i'm going for a walk with james so i'm literally need to get myself together because i'm supposed to meet him in like an hour hour and a half um well, they're saying that he's not messaged me to say he's woken up yet. So um, I'm not really, I'm not rushing. I'm kind of like, take my time, you know. So yeah, I will see you guys at some point later on. I'm going to, um, I want to do a workout later on. I haven't done a workout since, technically I haven't done a proper workout since Friday. Um, I did a run on Saturday, which you'll see there's a video coming on Wednesday, I think this week. I think it's Wednesday and not Thursday because it's a collab. Um, I won't say what it is, but you'll see why I went for a run on Wednesday. Um, so my legs have been absolutely dead from that. So I've been so. taking it easy. I did yoga on Sunday and yesterday I babysitted and I thought, you know what, I'm not doing a workout afterwards. Like my legs, they're just not quite up for it. And I, I'm glad that I t took that time like to listen to my body. Um, so hopefully later on I'll be up for doing upper body. I thought normally I'd do lower body first, lower body, then upper body and then hip or whatever. Um, but I think I'm just going to skip the legs this week because my legs just, I'm just going to wait until Friday because that'll be, I think Friday will be booty. So, um, but I've also, st I'm starting the new Beyond Guide, which is called Energy and it's a new home guide. So I'm hoping to start that tonight. But um, yeah, I'll see you later on, guys. 
guys happy wednesday is it wednesday yeah it's wednesday um so also i don't, don't know if you're gonna hear my laptop just like trying to take off in the background um i'm trying to i'll tell you in a second but basically today i did babysitting this morning and i stayed there until three o'clock and then i just come home just was chilling did some editing did some youtube stuff um and then i did a workout um at like six half five six and i just had a shower and i'm just chilling watching my friend isabel's vlog her moving out vlog um she said it's doing really well which is amazing so if you haven't checked it out yet then you should um to check out her channel because I am so excited for her moving content anyway. So yeah, I've just not had a lot to vlog about today. I wasn't even going to vlog, but I thought I'd come on and just talk to you about my um, my laptop because I'm trying to... Basically, I bought this hard drive like a year ago nearly probably. Um, and it was 50 quid. Like, it was a lot of money. And then I had problems... Well, it worked for a while. And then I had problems with it. And it wouldn't work. And then I just gave up on it. And then basically what happened was... Um, so I stopped using my, my laptop to edit on the end because I was working and it ended up being easier just to edit on my phone because everything was kind of in one place. Um, and now recently I've decided that I want to try and edit on my on my iPad, not my laptop again, because why do I want to edit on my laptop again? Because, because I've started using iMovie because I've got these pop-ups and I can't, the app that I use on my phone originally, I can't, um, I can't, do like a green screen so i could i can still use imovie on my phone but um i just thought well i may as well try and use my laptop it would you know you can see it a bit better um there's a bigger screen and yeah so i've tried to export it um onto the hard drive and the hard drive it won't save onto the hard drive i don't really know why um basically like a few months back like probably like six months probably now um i spent like one a ho nearly a whole evening talking to someone on, on amazon um about it um like a customer service thing and they put me through to different people and they ended up helping me and i think they like cleared the hard, hard drive off so that like or did something to it to stop to um or clean the, the file type or something and then they said it should work um and it like plugs in and i find that it like basically unplugs itself or like it's not even unplugging itself but you know it's coming eject um is that the word um I've tried it like three or four times now and it won't export onto the hard drive. So I've given up and thought, because basically the other day I managed to um, delete loads of stuff off my laptop. I think what it was taking up so much space was that um, I had so much in my iMovie, iMovie li library. So I deleted loads of stuff and I managed to free up like 60 gigabytes. Um, so now I have like 60 gigabytes left on my laptop. So it's not at the end of the world, I have to use the laptop. This was really annoying because the hard drive was 50 quid and if it's just basically a waste of my money. Um, and now obviously it's far too late to try and send it back and I've already tried to sort it. But yeah, um, I'm trying to export it onto the laptop now. Hopefully that'll work. Um, technology is just a nightmare. I'm just not good at it. This is why I was editing on my phone because it was just easier. Um, and literally the laptop sounds like it's taking off. So um, it is like a 2015 one. It's not like only one it is it's not got i think it's only got like eight eight gigabytes of storage um so yeah i'm basically just gonna make some tea um that is me for the night so i will see you guys tomorrow probably on or whenever i'm not really doing a lot this week now um i'm not doing any more babysitting for the week so i'm not sure what i'm gonna do really so i'll see you when i see you <laughs> Hey guys, happy Thursday. I just thought, I'm gonna see my car. I just got home and I thought I would very quickly show you what I got from Sainsbury's. Nothing that exciting, but this is what the vlogs come to. I'm just like, show you what I got from Sainsbury's. Um, so I've never seen, um, apparently they're not a new thing, but I got two fat. I got two packets of mini cheddars. I've got these, they're lime and chili mini cheddars. And I got another packet as well, um, which was, um, where are they? Ah, cheese nachos, nacho cheese and jalapeno. I was like, oh my God. So I've got them. Um, I've got some stir fry vegetables because I'm loving stir fries at the moment. I'm so obsessed. Um, 
I got some of these Richmond Mund meat sausages. So I really want to try these. I got some strawberries. I got I have loads of. I don't go to Sainsbury's very often. I need to actually go in because this stuff is getting defrosted. Um, but they do actually have loads of stuff from the freezer section in Sainsbury's. Well, not just the freezer section, like meat-free um, or vegan stuff. Like these are just meat-free mini sausages, which I thought was obviously not sausages, but meat-free sausage rolls. Um, I got some strawberries, I got some corn chicken, oh, corn chicken pieces, some Linda McCartney vegetarian sausages, some tofu, because I really want to start trying like, to put that in more meals because it's good for protein and it's, I'm finding it hard to get high protein things in at the moment because I'm not having like chicken. Um, and a mango because I wanted some fresh mango, I haven't had that in a while. And yeah, oh, and some cotton wool pads. Because I just can't seem to get on. I don't know whether anyone else finds this. I really struggle to get on with the reusable cotton wool pads. Because a lot of the time I find that the product just goes like through the cotton wool pad and just grips. And I'm like, well, that's a waste of my money. Like buying Mr. Airwater product to go on it. If it's just going to grip on the floor. Um, so yeah, um, smaller problems. Also, one more thing. I bought a concealer in there. Because I basically I ran out of my concealer. And they didn't have um, collection in there. But they had this brand. I think I can't find it. Where is it? It's in the bottom of there somewhere. Ah. Um, it's called a boutique. And basically it was the cheapest concealer I could find. And I just thought they had a whole other range of stuff as well. And I just thought I'd give it a go. It's called Boutique. Boutique, boutique, um, moisturising concealer, and I got it in the shade light. I did wonder, if, I did think, is it going to be too light because it's quite light. Um, the medium was like, I thought, I'm not sure. I thought it looked a bit too um, orangey. Um, not that it didn't look dark, but yeah. Um, so I thought I'd give it a go because it was three pounds. That was really cheap. Um, so I'm going to give that a go because I ran out of my collection one. If not, I'm just going to order another collection one but i thought for three pounds i could give that a go um, and yeah i'm gonna go in and just basically gonna do some editing in fact i will catch up with you guys in a second because um my glossy box came this morning so i'll will unbox the glossy box and have a little look in a minute so i'm gonna get this back in have a snack i think and then i'll see you for a glossy box unboxing hey guys so it's actually now like an hour later nearly um i've just been faffing around i walked up to the shop and um, dropped off my ASOS parcel because I forgot to do it earlier. So we're gonna look at this month's glossy box. Eva's sat on my bed because she wanted to see and I told her we had to do it for the vlog. So um, she's just being annoying. So this but month, is it a certain theme? It's called Pretty Pleasures, beauty, beauty Treats. I'm pretty, I've seen something, that I've got a feeling there's a mascara in this one. Um, I don't tell people before you open it. I'm gonna open it anyway, so. Because you're in it. I don't know. It doesn't matter. Sorry, vlog. She's still learning how to use her phone. Okay, so ooh, we got a sponge. I like a sponge. Um, this is a so eco in the kitchen to clean anything. Shut up. So eco complexion sponge. Um, a hundred times sponge equals tree. So it's more eco friendly than normal sponges, I guess. Um, super soft and cruelty free. Um, this complexion sponge is perfect for flawless custom for foundation. So it's responsibly and ethically sourced. So that's cool. How much is that one worth? Let's have a look at the little card. No, six pounds. The RIP. And then we've got no. We can see that. That's good though because I needed a new sponge because mine is starting to look a bit gross. Um, a nourishing mascara, like I said, and this is from. Beauty. Hang on, let me see how much it is. That's £15.50 and that's a full-size one. Yeah, and what's the brand called? Butanic Beauty. Butanic Beauty. I've not heard that brand before. Have you heard that beauty brand before? No, but it looks like a cool bottle. It's like a, a, a pushy-up. It looks like a liquid. Lip that's good. I, I'm, I've recently started using Oh, you've got a new primer. I need one of them. Eva, let me actually get through the box before you tell me what's in it. This is the mascara. Oh, it's different. Oh, it comes out it's like that. Cool that's different. Bottle. That is cool. I... I am getting into mascara at the moment, so um, that is good. Right, I'm one. excited to try that. What's next? Next, we've got a nail varnish. Yep, yeah, by Nail Zinc. You're like, yeah, tick. Nail Zinc. £11. £11. £11. And it's a nice kind of duck, I say like a duck 
Blue, grey. Oh, I'm put your paper behind. I think it looks more grey on camera, but it is. I'm doing that thing where you like put your piece of paper behind. It's like a duck. I'd say it's like a duck blue, behind. but more. <laughs> it's like a duck blue, but it's got like, a grey tinge to it as well. Um, That's what duck blue is. I actually need to paint my nails. But. I knew gels. And then we've got an eyeliner, an eye pencil. That was £10 by Lord and Berry. It's a Dulux Mini. I don't want to use um, pencils. I'm, I'm, maybe that can go in like a giveaway. I need to start like collecting things for like a 1K giveaway. Um, so maybe that can go in my giveaway. Gonna have. And a primer. They're not having I've it. Been, I've no. never got photos and I ran out of primer. No, it's my primer. Check out Get Amy's your own Instagram glossy box. Yeah. That's 30 um, pounds. That's a full size. 30, oh, that's a lot. I'm not definitely not giving you that. So what's all together this month I is worth? That much. 10 to 48 50 55 50 61 pound 50 so it's not it's not i don't know i'm it's a nice it's a nice box it's like sometimes it's like over 100 pounds so it's not a, it's not like wow but i do think all the things yeah, it that, might be more yeah, most yeah, like yeah. pretty much all these things except from that little pencil i would use um so that's what i love about glossy box um that it's always stuff that you're pretty much going to use. And if you aren't going to use it, you can give it to someone else. Exactly. But, you know, but I'm not going to give it to you. Um, but, yeah, glossy boxes are always... I think it's like they're always worth more than £50 and you pay, like, £13. It's definitely worth it. I would definitely recommend it to anyone. Not an ad. Um, oh, so <laughs> cringe. You're never going to get an ad by... Oh, shut up! I'm going to get an ad for glossy box. If Don't you're watching you this around. glossy box, then hit me up, clicks. Oh, watching it. Why would they want to watch you? Then? Hey, shut up. And that primer was caught by um, Figs and Rogue, which I've not heard of. But... I'm sorry for celebrity in that. Yeah. So, yeah, that is this month's glossy box. Um, love it. I guess love it when it comes. It's such like a little surprise that when it came this morning, I get like a little text saying, your glossy box has been delivered. And I'm like, oh. So, I'm going to probably sign off for today um, because... I'm not going to do a lot of Tomorrow we've got a big day, haven't we? We're doing Meals on Wheels tomorrow, aren't we? Yeah. Maybe we'll do a little vlog of oh, Meals no. on Wheels. You know what you can vlog in a minute? I was trying to get the present out of the car again. Yeah. We anyway, I will see you there. tomorrow, guys. Also, I popped my butt my butterfly bedding on this morning and Stanley's just sit on the sat it's here. Squishing. I'm not squishing him. I'm sat on my pillow. Look at him. He's so cute. He's just sat there. See ya. Wouldn't want to be ya. <laughs> hey, guys. Happy... Friday. I always have to think what day it is. Um, I've just done an upper body workout. Um, also this morning I made some baked oats for breakfast. I made Eva some baked oats. What was your verdict, Eva? Um, also, I was going to quickly show you how cute are my cats. I literally just did a workout. Come back and look at them. They're both now they're both looking at me like who's she talking to? Look at them. Are oh, you guys so cute? You're both just chilling. Also, have I shown you the butterfly bedding? I'm not sure if I have. Pro I have. I have, but not like fully. Um, yeah, this is the butterfly bedding and it looks so cute. And I think the cats love it just as much as me because, yeah. Let's go ask Eva what a verdict of the baked oats were. Did you like your baked oats? Yeah, they were okay. Yeah. You're okay. I get the hype. I love them. Um, but yeah, I'm going to. No, it's so mean. Um, I'm just on the door. Coffee. Okay, I'm going. I'm going. I just had a very excited, exciting parcel. Um, I don't know when I'm going to actually film this and upload it. I, it was one of those ones that I the other week uploaded. Um, uploaded. Um, ordered. Um, it's from one of my favourite shops that I've not actually order from for a while so i don't know when i'm gonna film it maybe tomorrow because i don't know if i'll film it today but um little haul coming for you guys so yeah i'm going to we're gonna go and do meals on wheels in in about 20 minutes i think what time is it now it's quarter 10 past 11 so yeah 20 minutes we're going to do meals on wheels and then i'm gonna come home and to wash my hair um and i'm just gonna spend the rest of the day chilling and editing um so me and my cats. We'll see you later. Hey guys, it's a bit later on now. I was going to shower earlier um, and wash my hair, but I just was a bit like, basically, I what did I do? 
I sat and edited for a bit after we did Meals on Wheels. We did Meals on Wheels, went edited for a bit, and then I made my lunch, and then, then I made a cup of tea. And then basically, I've just come to B&M again, um, because, so you can't see the B&M sign in the background, um, that table we bought the other day, um, when my sister opened it up today, um, she noticed there's some like cracks on it. So she thought, oh, she's gone to school this afternoon for six to six form. Um, and she was like, oh, can you take it back? And um, like, see if you can swap it for like another table we still got the chairs at home but i'm gonna see if they can swap it um so that's what i'm here for and then i think while i'm here i'll probably have like a little look around um not that i need anything but um if i'm here you may as well you know you may as well have a wonder i also have to go and pick up a parcel um which i completely forgot about the other day i had a notification it's from it's something from vinted um i won't be showing you because it's i'm doing like i'm filming a video which you probably won't see for like a month but um yeah i, I had like a notification saying oh your parcel's like here on monday and so i went there and they were like oh no it's not here and i was like that's weird um and then i just completely forgot about it and then i think i had the notification on tuesday saying or went all wednesday saying it's here and i just forgot um so i finally remember this afternoon that i need to do that so on my way home i'm gonna go pick it up um so yeah um that's all i'm really doing but anything else to say no that's pretty much it so i'm gonna do that and i'll catch up with you later and i'm gonna have a bit of a Oh, I've got loads of stuff to sort out when I get home. Like I've got my room just needs to be able to sort out and tidy, and I'm gonna wash my hair. So I may even do that first, but I will see you when I'm home. Right, that is sorted. I didn't end up actually looking in B in B and M because it was just so embarrassing. I felt so embarrassed because like. I literally just walked in there with this massive table and chairs thing like this and um, I just went to, up to this lady who ha was like on a checkout desk but she was free um, and I just said to her and she was like yeah that's fine was, like she was really not fine about it like she was happy for me to swap it so I went and got what I thought was the right one and nearly dropped a table on, like a chair on the floor hopefully it didn't break it and this lady was like oh you okay and I was like yeah um, and then I um, so she, I went back to the lady with this table and she was like, oh no, that's the wrong one. I was like, oh yeah, shit. Sure. Um, went and got the right one and then I see how to open it to check that it didn't have any cracks in it. But when I opened it, like the first, the original one we bought, I was like, oh my God, those cracks are tiny either. Like, just like a few little lines. I was like, really? I mean, it's clear if it's going to probably do crack. Like, oh, I just really hope this one this one doesn't crack on the way home because then I'll be responsible for it. But it's just so embarrassing and I was going to like have a little look around afterwards. But obviously, I didn't really think that through very well because I couldn't really because I had a big, t like, a big table that I was carrying. So I couldn't really just walk around afterwards. Obviously, I would have had to like put this back in my car and then go back in. And I was like, I can't deal with doing that afterwards. I don't need anything anyway. And I don't get paid till, till Monday and I have like 30 quid till then, which... So yeah, I don't need to spend any more. So yeah, I'm gonna go and pick up that parcel now and take this home. I think it's gonna have to stay in my car though because my mum's at home. Um, so I think it's gonna have to stay there for now. So I will see you when I'm home. Morning guys, happy Saturday. Um, I look like a mess this morning. I'm about to put some makeup on. I was gonna film a haul, but I'm not sure who I am. I might go for a walk with a friend, but I'm definitely gonna put some makeup on anyway. But basically my, my mum just said to me, she was like, that we've got loads of bags of clothes like in our, garage space and she was like are you selling it or what i hate really she hates having the space god i'm so out of breath i need to drink water yeah so basically she hates like the space like it being there when it's like taking up space which i get um and she was like i'm gonna go to tesco's apparently they like you can like you can drop things off there and they'll give it to charity so i took off quite a few items off my vintage because like they weren't getting so old they've been on there for months and they weren't selling but while I did that, I found another bag of clothes full of like summer clothes, which I'd sorted out. And I think they were on my vintage, but I'd taken them off. Um, or I can't remember whether, I can't really remember to be fair. But um, I've literally just dug out, uh, so before she went, I was like, right, I'm grabbing, I've got a massive pile of clothes here, let me show yeah, you. Yeah, I've got this massive pile here. Um, and I think I'm gonna try, cause she was taking stuff to the clarity to be, you know, to go to like clarity shops and stuff. But I was like, I'm gonna try and sell some of those things on Vinted again because they're like summer clothes. Whereas like, I think the winter clothes, like they just weren't selling anymore because obviously people aren't really looking for winter clothes that much anymore because like, even though it's not, it's not summer yet, but I just don't think people are looking for, you know, big thick woolly jumpers. 
um, all things like that. So I said she would take that off and I just hopefully I'll be able to sell some of that stuff. So hey guys, yeah. happy Sunday. Happy, it's Mother's Day today. Um, so happy Mother's Day to anyone, whether you're a mum, whether you're a dog mum, whether you're a daughter. I hope everyone had a lovely day by the time you're watching this. Um, it's currently nearly half ten. I'm just about to do my Sunday morning yoga with my friend Kirsty. Um, if you haven't heard me talk about her before, I'll link her website down below and you can definitely get involved if you want to do some yoga at the moment. Um, I'm really excited and I think I want to put you guys on a time lapse and do a little yoga time lapse. I've not done a yoga time lapse in a while. So, cue the time lapse and then basically today we're having a clear day at home and um, we've bought some nice different foods today. We're going to do like a little like picky kind of lunch, if you know what I mean, like a a picky lunch, bits and bobs, and then we're doing a roast tonight. Well, I say we're doing a roast, my sister's doing a roast, um, because my 18 year old sister can cook better than I can, um, so that's gonna be good, and yeah, it's gonna be a nice little day. I think I'm gonna put a bit of makeup on after yoga, it just makes myself feel better. I've got some cute new clothes from Sheen, which um, a haul is coming. Like, I think I said this already, um, I did a, I filmed the haul last yesterday afternoon, um, and I'm gonna wear one of my jumpers, um, so sneak peek. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go and set myself up, up for yoga and I'll see you later. Basically, I just tried this primer, this one from the Glossy Box, and I don't know if I've done it wrong, because I don't even know if you can tell, but I popped the primer on, and it dried, like, really weirdly, like, it dry, it felt quite dry, was that stupid, um, and I just popped my foundation on, I use, um, at the moment I'm using the, I, I say at the moment, this is what I always go for, the Bourjois Healthy Mix Serum Gel Foundation, um, it's really lightweight, so if you really want like a lightweight foundation, this is really good. Um, and I don't think you can even tell. It You definitely can't tell on my phone. I can't see it on my phone so much. But looking in my mirror, I've just got this like block from like my neck to here. I don't know if you can tell, but it just looks so orange. And it's just like a block. Like normally it doesn't go like that. And then I tried blending it down my neck to like my foundation down my neck to blend it in and it went really like the foundation went really flaky and I've, now I've just got this patch on my neck here which I don't think you can even tell like you can't see it on the camera or maybe you can I don't know but that's not good this is this was like 38 quid so I don't know it's blurring and finishing primer it does say to moisturize before application Pat pro okay, so you're supposed to pat it evenly onto the T-zone and across cheeks. Maybe I did that wrong. Alternatively, you use over makeup with pressing lightly. I did I did moisturise, but I did my yoga and I I moisturised before then, so like over an hour, like an hour and a half now. So maybe I should have moisturised first and then put it on. And I forgot that it does say that you have to pat it in, which I didn't pat it in. I just, like you normally would. But... I'll let you know if I can um, sort this out. Uh, it's a weird later. angle because you just balance like in my duvet. Um, this concealer, um, I've, this is the second time I've used it. I'm about to blend it in. And it's okay to be fair. Um, I mean, it, I think it's lighter. Let me pick you up. It's lighter than my usual concealer, but it probably would be really good for me like in the winter. Um, this kind of shade. But um, I would probably just stick with collection because I prefer it. Um, but it is, it's all right for £3. Like I said, it's a bit lighter. But for £3, I haven't blended it in yet. I'll show you in a sec when it's blended. Let me blend it. Um, and you don't get a lot, like, on, like, a lot doesn't come out when you pull it out. But, I mean, it's only a small little one, isn't it? So, okay, that is it blended. Like I said, I think it is a bit light for me. But with bronzing up, it'll be fine. And obviously, I haven't even powdered my face yet, so I look a little bit of a mess. But, um... Yeah, and I think it, my makeup looks okay now. I went to the bathroom to have a little look 
and I think it's okay. It, I think it looks worse in this angle, like this light. Um, the bathroom light is lighter and it didn't look too bad. So I think it's looking okay. I'm going to go and give myself a bit of a bronze. Um, also, I tried um, this mascara yesterday, the one that was in the glossy box. And it's nice. To be fair, it's if it's not like I put it on and I was like, oh, it's like nothing is coming out of it. Um, but I don't think it's supposed to be like that. It's supposed to be more of like a natural one. And it's not supposed to be super black. It's like, like it says, it's a nourishing mascara. So I think it's probably better for like a day if you're not going to wear makeup or lot, a lot of makeup. And you just want something on your lashes, but not like a full on like coating um it's really nice so i would recommend if that's what you want but if you want like a black full black like coat your lashes mascara then not the one hun okay okay so you get like a whole makeup review here on a sunday <laughs> also does anyone like under under their eyes like crease like crazy like when i'm doing my makeup my base i have to like go and go under like so many times because they just crease and then i'll go and like now i'll go and do my cream contour and then before i bake under my eyes i have to like go back in with the beauty blender because they will crease so quickly it's so annoying I'm ready it is nearly one o'clock and i'm you know ready but i um i really like my outfit but i'm really debating putting leggings on because i literally had a pair of like comfy leggings on and then I've just put jeans on and I'm it's literally I'm about to go eat and I'm like, I don't think I can sit and eat in these jeans. Let me show you my outfit before I change into leggings. This jumper is so cute. Like I said, I've got a Sheen haul, haul come and see with us in. Um and these jeans. And it's a really cute outfit. And I can imagine this with with some trainers. Like if I if I was actually going somewhere, it would look really cute. Um but I'm not, am I? So I think I'm definitely gonna switch into some leggings. So I'm in jeans for about a minute. And Okay, that is so much better just putting a pair of black leggings on. It still looks cute, but I'm comfortable. Also, I don't think I said um, yesterday my stomach was playing up and today. Wow. So it's my own fault that like, I ate foods that I know I shouldn't be eating. Or So Friday evening, we, me and my sister did the Meals on Wheels on Friday. And the, the pub that do like cook the food for us... Um, they had some leftovers and they were like, oh, you can just keep it. And the actual meal I couldn't have because it wasn't vegetarian. It was like a meat pie. Um, but the pudding was a cheesecake, which I shouldn't have had because it's dairy. But I was like, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. And I was absolutely fine. I had it on Friday evening. Saturday, I was fine. Wait, was it Saturday? Yeah, Saturday lunchtime, I was absolutely fine. But I just didn't eat, didn't eat a lot yesterday. I was kind of like, I think I had for breakfast, I had, I had a small bowl of like, white chocolate cocoa pops um and then a cereal bar and then when i got home from my walk in the afternoon i was starving um so i had but i saw we had some like cheese triangles in the fridge and i was like oh cream cheese cheese on a bit of toast and i had some cream cheese on toast and some baked beans and i thought it'd be fine it'd be fine and then i started filming my clean haul or, or uh, then i started filming my clean haul and just like when i was doing that my stomach heart started to hurt and i was like that's weird um, I don't know whether because I had the cream cheese, maybe like the dairy kind of caught up on me from having the cheesecake the night before. And then it was like, you know, you know, hold off, like stop it. You know, like you took the piss a bit last night with the cheesecake and we let you off. But that cream cheese, I mean, there's only a tiny little triangle though. So yeah, I don't know. Last night I just wasn't feeling too great. Um, I ended up having burritos with chips for tea. I probably shouldn't have had such a big meal for my tea. Um... And then I ate, I ate loads of chocolates afterwards as well. Honestly, I had my worst nightmare. Um, So I got up this morning. I didn't eat until like midday. And I wasn't going to eat until my lunch in a minute. But I just had to have something. So I just had a bagel and a little um one of those little blueberry muffin fibre bar things. Um, And we're going to have lunch now. It's going to be some good food. So I'm looking forward to that. Hopefully it'll sort me out. Um, We're having like a picky lunch. So yeah, I'll catch up with you later. Um... I'm excited to go and eat some good food. Hey guys, it's a couple of hours, well, an hour and a bit later on now. Um, we had our lunch, it was lovely, wasn't it, Eva? I cooked it. Yeah, Eva cooked it, thanks, Eva. Um, and me and Eva, Eva, me and Eva just on a little drive because we're doing our like little like Sunday photo shoot again. Um, and we decided to drive into town. Um, this is going to be the new Costa, right? Oh, is there going to be a new Costa yeah, there? New Costa, but not drive through. Surely it would be drive through. No, because you've got Burger King drive through, and the drive through is just up there, or just up there. Oh, 
Yeah. So, um, yeah, we're going to drive. We thought we didn't know where to go, so we thought we'd go to Gloucester. There's a car park there. Maybe we'll get some car park photo shoots. Um, I've got an idea that we should do home bargains. No. Please. Mask. You do? Yeah, well, I'm going to get a one, so. Because you had two? One of them already worn, it's disposable, which is good for me. Anyway, so we're going to do that. <laughs> and I will see you later. Guys, we're at the car park. Honestly, I feel like. Yeah, we've not taken any photos yet. We've only just come here. But I feel like such an Instagrammer already. Like, if you're not following my Instagram, then make sure you do. I'll pop the little the thing. Yeah, the content is getting good. And my Instagram. Not that any photos go on my so Instagram. So, keys. <laughs> so, yeah. Let's get some good Instagram pics. Hayley's just running back to the car to get my camera bag. Because we're going to try and set up the phone to do a time lapse for you. Um, so, yeah. Nice empty car. <laughs> Um, I just had a little parcel come from my vitamins. I ordered um, this. I didn't realize it would be such a big box. Apple cider vinegar gum gummies. Apple cider vinegar gummies. I use Gemma Louise Miles discount code. I'm pretty sure her discount code is Gemma if you want to get some. And it's like, gives you like, well, it says 55% off, but I don't think it's actually 55. But anyway, I was interested to see what these are like. I'll try one in a sec. And I also bought some this little set which is basically like a raspberry ex extract and a white kidney bean extract and it's supposed to be like help you with like weight loss like i guess i don't really know how and then i also got these free because um which are bio bites um oh, high yeah. fiber high protein um so that i think they'll be quite good to put in baked oats or something um Let's try one of these and see if they're nice because I've always wanted apple cider vinegar, but they taste gross. Eva's just looking at the photos that we took on the camera. Sorry, you can't even see me. Oh, it's not quite. Oh, it's not alright. Oh, they're not bad. Want to try one? No, thanks. We're not coming. Hmm? Oh, here's a, here's a King Square. I took a photo of it. Right, let me go back to the gym. Yeah, I will. You want to see them later? I'll just turn the camera around <clears> and show them my photos. No. no. You don't want to see them yet because otherwise it'll be a spoiler, a, a, a spoiler for the gram. On the gram now. Mm -hmm. Follow me. Follow me. I'm just done with it. Guys, um, it's now like a couple of hours later. It's like half five. I've been sat here editing the vlog for the last hour. I've ha been having troubles with my laptop and like storage. Like if anyone is like a small YouTuber and they have like a laptop and like basically I've been trying the, the hard drive, but the hard drive won't work. I've explained this already. Um, and then I was trying to basically it was telling me the storage was full because my iMovie i my iMovie library takes up so much space, and I was deleting my whole iMovie library, deleting the videos, a couple of videos that I did, did have, have on the laptop. Um, so yeah, and it's been a nightmare, but I've just about managed to export the last, like send the last few clips, like airdrop them. So hopefully that'll be okay. And I don't, I don't even know how I'm going to export this because it's just not going to be any good, is it? I, I just think I've had so much trouble with me trying to export like a nearly 40 minute video. It's going to be difficult. So yeah, I'm going to try and export this now. And thank you for watching the vlog. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up and leave me a comment down below. And make sure you subscribe if you're new here and turn the notification bell. I'll see you guys very, very soon for a new video. But there will not be a new video this week. Instead of Thursday's upload, it'll be Friday. So there'll be no video on Thursday. But my Thursday upload will technically be on Friday. And then Saturday is like normal. So yeah, um, I'll see you on Friday. And I'll see you then. Bye. Thank you.